Yeah, you know what's crazy about that is I, I relate to that so, so, so much. Because, um, like, my best friend Evan, Flower Cop. Yeah, Flower Cop. Like, <laughs> bro, like, I, I swear it's, like, the same thing. Like, yeah. people always ask me, like, yo, where's Flower Cop? Yo, what's up with Flower Cop? And, like, people think we're beefing, but it's just, like... It's just, like, bro, get off my just, dick. Yeah, we just need to, <laughs> like, like... It's, like, bro, like, bro, it's, like... Like, all right, I'm gonna give a perfect, I'm gonna give a perfect example. Like, my girl has been on Periscope. My fans will come on and be like, "Yo, what's going on with X and Ski?" Yeah. Who the fuck wants to see that? <laughs> yeah. Like, what, like, what the fuck? That's the last thing I want a fan asking my girlfriend. You feel yeah, me? Like, yeah. like I'll see that shit and I'll be like, "Yo, like, what the fuck is wrong with y'all?" You feel me? But I'm not about to snap on my fans. No, but this is the, this is the, this is me speaking out on it. Stop that shit. We fucking hate that shit. If you keep doing that shit, we're gonna fucking diss you. Be smart. If you have if you have your own life, you don't want anybody else asking you about your best friend's fucking life. Yeah. They want you want your spotlight to be your spotlight. I've got. I mean, it doesn't bother me because I haven't said anything yet. I got asked a question. It doesn't bother me, but don't do it. It's it's annoying. It's annoying and it's childish. No, I, I, yo, I'm telling you, I relate to that so much, and it's it's kind of put a strain on my my relationship with him because because people always ask me. It puts about a strain him. on you. You're weak. You think so? Yeah, I think you're weak if you it puts a strain on you because as brothers or as friends, what the fuck does it matter? No, you're, you're gonna, right. You're, you're right, gonna but, realize that pride. But I feel like I feel like it has caused some separation. Yeah, pride is a burden, man. Pride yeah. is a fucking burden because with anything in life, you're gonna realize everything will shit on your pride. Yeah. It's gonna piss and shit and slap. Such, your pride I try in to your be such a face. humble person though. But you don't. It's, it's hard. You don't sometimes. if you, you don't if you if you if get, it puts a strain if you, on. It puts a strain on you. You're right. You're 100 percent right. You just gotta pretty much like. Take it as it is. It's like, all right, people are people are gonna ask these questions. What the yeah. fuck is it gonna do to me? Does it does it decrease your money worth? No. It, does right. it harm you or him? No. It's just pretty much saying, hey, we're reminding you that your pride, it, yeah. you know, is gonna fuck you. Hundred no, <laughs> percent right. You're, that, that's yeah. so real. That's so. Man, so pretty much, real. bro. The way I see it, as long as your best friend doesn't try and fuck you over in any sort of way, you're good. Nothing else matters. I'm about to call Evan after this interview. <laughs> good. Good. You're going to you're gonna realize, bro. I've, bro. I've gone through so fucking much, man. I've gone through so fucking much. No, I feel like you're you're super wise, though. Like, like, I don't know. It's crazy. The first time I met you and the first time we, like... Not the first time I met you, but the first time, like, you came through and, like, we went to my, 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 home, my homie's crib. Yeah. And we were chilling. Like, I, I realized, like, how smart you actually were. Like, you... Yeah. You... I love the love now. I love love now. I, I mean, I, even, I could tell. I think though, I was smart before. I think you were smart, but you just maybe you're more smart now. Mm. But like, I just like, I don't know, man. I, I really, I don't even, I can't even put a word on it. But I'm just, it's just, it just, it shows me that you're in a place because you deserve to be in a place. You know what I mean? <laughs> because the, the the thought like, is there. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, like some people just literally wing it. And yeah, get yeah, exactly. <laughs> Exactly. Yeah. No, no, like, yeah, I plan this. I it plan it this, shows me that, like, it, it kind of shows the separation. It kind of shows me why you are where you are and other people aren't where they are. You know what I mean? Nobody, nobody will ever have the spot I have because anything after me will be imitated. Yeah, and, oh, boom, that's another question I wanted to ask. Like, since you've been gone, like, like I've literally gone to shows and just, like, seen people, like... Like do you, do you realize how influential you are to yeah. like, the South Florida scene? I, no, I've, like, I've seen the influence. I've seen the influence. Like, as far is, as music, yes. It's crazy, bro. How like, many people try to imitate my music? Yes. Try to imitate your music and just like when they go to perform, like they even trying like do use some of your mannerisms. Like I yeah. seen a kid perform and like he was dead ass, like doing what you do when you perform. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like I taught I taught a couple people how to perform. I don't know, but I don't think you taught this person, you know what I'm saying? I think it was just like, this dude's seen you perform a bunch yeah. of times. No, it happens. And just like, you it know happens. what I mean? Like, yeah, it happens. <laughs> that's yeah, just I, crazy. I, like I said. But you brought like an energy, you know what I'm saying? Like you brought like a whole energy. Like you wouldn't. You I, wouldn't think I, give a, I think I give performing a system. I give it a system. Um, when I come in, I expect a certain thing. You expect a certain thing out of me. Why the fuck would I come there and expect you to look at me? Like, yeah. if you're going to do that, if you're going to come, I'm saying this to everybody. If you're going to come to my shows and look at me and you're not going to like, like punch me in my shit. Yeah. Like, get the fuck out of my show. You know what's so crazy is I'll be filming you sometimes. And I'm like, fuck, do I film this shit? Or, or do I jump in this shit? Like, <laughs> yeah, man. Like, no, nah, man. Like, no, nah, man. I, I, I got a system to this shit. Like, when I come, like, I want to cause world chaos. Like, I, I've had, like, I've had some people tell me, like, man, they feel like, like I bring up hell, like I, I make hell rise from the ground when I perform. I could feel that. Yeah, it's because that. that energy, like, all I do. See, the thing is, a lot of like you're gonna realize all of life revolves around energy, bro. And I mean, like, 
I mean it when I say a lot of these artists take energy from their fans and shit. I don't do that. I just make you fucking like. I feel like you like, give energy. Yeah, I, I kind of do. Admit, like, you I'll, I'll literally, energy. I'll have you admit energy. I'll add mine to it. Have you spit it at me, spit it back at you, and have it multiply. Yeah. Pretty much, and then I'll just end up like drained after. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but it's all, it's all like it's always good because then in in the long run, with me not being selfish with as far as with the energy I'm giving, I always get it back and more. Yeah. So it's really about it's really about having that passive state of mind. Pretty much, it's like, like man, if you're if you're more accepting and you're more like, and you're less con like, you're less of a conformist with anything that you do, man, you get rewarded a fuckload, man. So like, if some shit happens to you and you accept it, man, you gonna get rewarded. And I mean that, like horrible shit is gonna happen to people. Horrible shit is gonna happen to me. I mean, good shit is gonna happen to me. Wonderful shit is gonna happen to me, but horrible shit is gonna happen to me. So, I mean, I, all I can do is accept it or else it's gonna just, it's gonna break me. Do you feel like you, you maybe, maybe you expect a lot out of people sometimes or do you not feel like you-, you No, I don't expect anything out of anyone anymore. But you My just- My expectations are low. That's, I mean, and it's- So if somebody, if so somebody, if somebody can't even meet your low expectations- nope. It's no, like, I expect, I'm starting not to expect anything from anyone. Have you learned People that? have broken my heart. Yeah. So you've learned to, like, just yeah, not even. I don't, I don't care for expectations anymore. Um, how do you feel about perp right now? You still, it's perp? still. Perp? perp? It's still um, perp. Here's what I'm going to do this. I went to jail. I had a long time around people that are, that legitimately do do this beef shit. Um, I have no beef with Space Ghost perp. I wish Space Ghost Perp the best in his career. I wish Space Ghost Perp the best in a lot of things. People probably don't realize it, but he he's smart. He's on beat because I see that he has a star of David tattooed on his on his forehead. I've gotten more into these uh, the spiritual awareness or or anything involving the soul, and I know that Space Ghost Perp is is on beat. So um, anything as far as that I perceived about him before, I mean we're not friends, man. We're not we we had beef, man, but. In all honesty, my 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 outlook on anything is if it's not gonna if it's not gonna affect me, why why am I giving it yeah. any attention? Yeah, yeah. Like we've, I mean, I tried to fight him before. We're not gonna fight. It's not it's not something that's gonna benefit us yeah, even if we do yeah. fight. You feel me? So yeah. at this point in time, it's really like I'm gonna just tell y'all this. I'm gonna just put it this way. I got something planned for Miami and Broward. That's that's gonna that's gonna make everybody sick. Let's say, hypothetically speaking, he sends you some beats. Are you rapping on him if you like? I'm going to do not? something in Florida that's going to make everyone sick. Yeah. And I mean down to the very, 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 very core of the underground in Florida. I'm going to make Florida what it was supposed to be. I'm going to make Florida the new Atlanta. Yeah. I, I, Atlanta is I on feel top like, of I feel like, I, yes, I I'm feel tired like of you are going to do what Perp yes. should have done. Yes. I do no, feel I'm that. I'm going to do what any person should have done. I'm not giving Perp any credit with that because anybody could have done it. Yeah. I feel 100%. like people gave, I feel like people held him too much to a bird and I feel like people expect too much of him. I'm gonna do what anybody should have done and if I don't do it, I'm gonna die trying. See, 100%. the thing is, I, like, I, I, like I was trying to say before, Atlanta runs this shit, man. Atlanta fucking runs this shit. The Migos, Gucci Mane, motherfucking uh, 21 Savage, 21 we Savage go forever. Young, Young Thug. Thug. We can go forever. Bro, man, we can go forever. how the, the fuck does Florida forever. want, bro? They're only a state above us. How the fuck does Florida want to put up with that shit? I feel like we, I feel like, I feel like sometimes I feel like that the re They stick like, together. They That's not what only it is. do they stick together. They have a system. They know how to operate. Like, they act as a family. Have you ever been to A3C? Because if you go to A3C, like you see how Atlanta operates and like they fuck with every, like, it could be a no, like nobody knows who this guy is and everybody's still turning up. You know what I'm saying? I feel yeah. like Florida's like a little like snobby about it. Like, you know what nah, I'm saying? No, I just feel like, bro, I feel like Broward and Miami niggas want to prosper by themselves and they're not willing to give yeah. out any handouts. Um, if somebody comes with, comes to me in need, of, in, need of, in need of teaching or in need of help, I will always try and offer while I can. I mean, I've seen a lot of people ask for just handouts in itself, but if you come to me with some sort of knowledge yeah. and show me that you are perceiving or show me, showing me you are on BR at the level I am of thinking, if you catch my attention, you feel me? Because I won't always, bro, you got to realize with a thousand messages, you're not always going to yeah, fucking want to respond, you feel 100%. me? 100%. I, I get like 20 messages and I'm already yeah, like overwhelmed exactly. about so, it. So with anything, bro, it's like if anybody comes to me and I peep that you're on B, I'm going to always say on B as far as like that you're on at my level of thinking. Yeah. If you're on B, man, I'm going to help you however I can. No, I mean, even with this, bro, like this is a blessing. Like, yeah. You doing this for me, like is a blessing, bro. Like... 
This is like this is beautiful. You always, I'm telling you, you always nice to me. I'm telling you, you called me and I had chills when you told me. Like I you're, had no, chills, no. bro. When you were always me. You, were, you were always nice to me. I just as far as like visual interviews, I'm leaving that shit alone because if I could have done an audio inter- uh, interview as far as no jumper, I definitely would have done it. But it wouldn't have been as much publicity. I got yeah. I got the public. Thank God for Adam, man. I fuck yo. If Adam hears this, man, Adam, yo, I yeah. love you. Shout bro. out to Adam if you hear this. I'm I, getting a no jumper tattoo. Yeah. I'm a yo, no I love. No, nah, I mean, I mean, I literally mean it when I say I love that nigga bro Adam is fucking cool bro like, and like yo not only that like yo that interview is one of the most viewed interviews yeah, yeah, yeah. and I was watching it like cause I, I, I look at I look at No Jumper every day bro and I was watching it after a week it had 80,000 type shit or yeah. after no, no, a month after, or something no, after, 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 after like 3 days I had like 20k it was crazy it was crazy and, and it was just jumping past all the interviews around it yeah. like I was looking at all the ones before it and it was flying nobody's talk, nobody's talk, nobody's talking about or nobody will talk about what I'm talking about ever because my mind my mind just like my mind is somewhere else somewhere else like I mean it and that's that's my problem my mind is somewhere else it's, it's a burden but it's also a it's great a thing yeah, yeah, it's also yeah. a gift but my mind is somewhere else man my mind will always be somewhere else and I'm just learning to accept it pretty much so that's where my individualism will always come in because my mind is somewhere else yeah